Just last year, 990 people were fatally shot by American police. 911, where is the emergency? 2724 Linden Boulevard. Um, this is a project. Somebody got shot on, in the stairs of the floor right here. Officer Peter Leang shot Akai Gurley while on patrol. Okay, ma'am, you saying someone was shot on the fifth floor? Yes, in my apartment building. Peter Leang could face up to 15 years in jail. I got the call that a Kai Gurley had been shot in uh, a dark stairwell in the Pink Houses, one of the roughest housing developments in Brooklyn, by a police officer, unarmed, and he was dead. My name is Mark Fleetner, and I uh, was the chief of the Civil Rights Bureau at the Brooklyn DA's office. Peter Liang was the defendant in the case. He was a rookie cop. He was few months out of the academy. We're gonna call names and whoever names we call are the selected jurors and mine was the first they called. My name is Mike Lyons and I was the foreman in the jury for the manslaughter case of Akai Gurley. Liang fired for no reason and then argued with his partner about calling the paramedics. In Brooklyn, demonstrators saying Liang is a scapegoat treated unfairly because he's Asian American. Dozens of members of this Chinese American community are also upset. Because of the fact that the Asian American community has not been as, as proactive politically, that this was an easy scapegoat. I'm angry for the system that has failed both Akai Gurley, Eric Gartner, and Peter Liang. We demand accountability! Black Lives Matter protesters felt jail time was warranted. We are disgusted with the justice system. Stop killing a kite again and again with your trick. There was one middle-aged black male on that jury. Oh, everyone should go to jail for when they make a mistake. He's not breathing. He's, he's not breathing. The cop there? The cop shot him. What happened? What were the rules? What were the circumstances? What were the results? It's not a reality show. It's, it's, a, it's a manslaughter trial. We're going to continue the fight until we get justice. There was a lot at stake because of the fact that it was one of the first shootings of an unarmed black man resulting in death that went to trial. And this was a time when police shootings of unarmed people were a topic of conversation nationally. I didn't realize just how high profile the case was. The bullet ricocheted off a wall and struck Gurley in the chest. He was unarmed. He had decided to have his sidearm ready. Unfortunately, he carried it wrong. One mistake ruined the life of one man and took the life of another. The trial was about whether somebody committed a reckless act. This is stuff that law students struggle with. I was proud of the conviction because it was historic in some ways. I wasn't proud of how the system played it out. Hunted down I came upon Place of ferns and grass Gathered to a redbud tree